Welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Charmaine and we are doing another eye look today but I will be using this Glam Light wine palette from the Happy Hour collection. And the palette looks like this on the inside so just shades of purple and you'll have to stay tuned to see which colors I use. So we'll go ahead and get into the look. All right, so I've already prepped my eyes as far as um, I put concealer on and I set that with my airspun powder. And now I'm just gonna go straight into, let's see, what color should I use? I think I'm gonna go with this deep purple here and I'm gonna just place that all over my lid. This purple color is called Vintage. Very pigmented. Glam Light just can do no wrong with their palettes. Um, I didn't get the latest collection, which was like the Icy collection, just because I really don't need any all blue or all red palettes. But I'll be waiting for the next collection to see what that is. Okay, so I'm patting that all over my lid. It, it's okay if it gets into my crease because I am going to be blending it out. Alright, so I have it packed onto my lid. Now I'm going to be taking, I kind of want to stick with the purple. So we're going to take this Pinot Noir color right here and we're going to put this in our crease and blend out vintage with it. Actually, I can use the mirror that's in the palette. So I'm just kind of patting that into my crease and then I will be blending these together. I'm kind of losing a little bit of vintage when I do that. All right, let's go ahead and add vintage back. And I'm just patting that back on there. I'm not blending it, just patting it. Okay, and I wanna use as many of these purple shades in here as I can. So, let's see. Let's take Maybe earthy hair. I'm gonna just use the same brush I used Pinot Noir on, and I'm gonna put that on the outside of Pinot. Trying to use as many colors as I can. Okay, and then we have two colors here. We have Napa, we have Fruity, actually we have Concord Grape and we have Sparkling Grape. I wanna put that on my lid, just over top of Vintage. So I'm gonna swatch them on my hand and try to figure out which one I wanna use. Okay, so this is Napa. This is Fruity. These are all like shimmer shades with some glitter. Let's see, Concord Grape. And then we have Sparkling. Okay. 
Hmm. I think I'm going to add Napa over top and see how that looks. And I'm just going to use my finger to add that on. So I'm just patting that on my lid. Now that I have that all over my lid, I feel like I'm gonna put a little bit of sparkling, which was the last shade, uh, this shade here, and see if that does anything extra. And I'm just tapping that into the center. That's pretty much it. And now I need to do the rest of my face and we'll come back. There's still two more items that I wanna use from this collection. So one of them is the Glam Light Pinot Noir Liquid Lipstick in this color here. I don't even know what the color looks like yet, to be honest, let's see. Okay, so the color, this is the color here. So I'll be using this lipstick. And we will be using the Glam Light Mimosa Highlighter from the collection as well. And that looks like this. So I'll be using this. And I'll just swatch this really quick. So that's the highlighter and I'll be using that. So I'll be right back once my face is all done. Okay, I'm back to finish off the highlighter and my lips since I'll be using Glam Light for that. But I do want to share some of the products I used on the rest of my face for foundation. I want to share this just because I don't usually use this one. So I used the Beauty Bakery Insta Bake today. I don't remember the last time I used it. I think it's been a while. And for my lashes, I'm going with the purple theme. So I picked up my Essence Get Big Lashes 3 Triple Black. For the eyeliner, I use this Glam Light Calligrapher pin in black. For the liner on my waterline, I use this ColourPop in the color Piggy Bank. For my blush, I used this Juvia's Place, the Saharan Blush Volume 2 palette. And I use this color right here, which is B, because it was kind of purpley. And what else did I use? Let's talk about my lower lash line. I mixed colors, so I used this color Cabernet Sauvignon. I don't know how to say that. And then I mixed it with, what did I mix it with? Oh, I put a little bit of vintage in the corner. So I used this and then vintage on the corner, the outer area. Okay, for contour, I used the Tan and Tulum palette by BH Cosmetics, looks like that. I just used this color here, which is Paradise. Now we're gonna get into the highlighter. Where's my special highlighter brush? Here it is. I like to use this brush for my highlighter. Um, so we're using this Mimosa highlighter from Glam Light. And it's my first time using it, so. Wow, this stuff is so pigmented. Okay, okay. For my lips, we're gonna use this ColourPop lippy in the color R N B. Okay, I think I called this the lippy. It's the lip liner in R N B, and then we'll put the Glam Light Pinot Noir on top. That's pretty. 
pretty. It looks a little bit brighter on camera than it is in person, but I do like these. It doesn't have any type of scent, like a sweet scent or anything. Their products don't usually have a scent, even though um, their food items are themed, food themed. So comment down below what you think of this look. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any future videos. Thanks for watching. I wanna let you know that you're better than I am what you do